CNC lathe. Okay, CNC lathe. We can say this is turning center. Okay, CNC lathe is nothing but a turning center. Okay, in this two axes, that is x axis and z axis are there. Okay, in CNC lathe machine is nothing but a turning center. In this turning center, we have two axes, that is x axis and z axis. Now, Okay, this is a component. Okay, so it will be a component. In this component, if you see in side, this is side view of the component. Yeah, and then mm -hmm. the view B. Like this. Like the side view and the front view. Now, here, this is known as origin point. We say this is origin point. Okay. Now, according to this CNC turning, we will be using two axes that is, one is x axis. And then is a taxis. If you see the graph, the graph, this is is a plus is a minus x plus x minus okay this is the graph x plus x minus z plus z minus based on this graph we will do the programming okay the graph plan will mention now in this side view in this side view like we mention this is Is it plus? Is it mine? X plus X minus. Okay. Based on this, <coughs> according to the CNC length mission, X indicates. Diameter is it indicates length. Yes, will be diameter. X is time. Is it now? Diameter under this length. Suppose we say mm -hmm. diameter 20. Okay, diameter 20. Mm -hmm. This diameter 30. This is 15. Like, okay, to so print 15. Mm -hmm. If you see inside of it, Yes, okay. Now, huh? what is the principle of a CNC lathe machine? That is, in CNC lathe machine, 
work piece will be rotating job will be rotating correct ah rotate two will be moving in upward direction or downward direction mm -hmm. what that is if the tool moving the tool movement will be in only upward direction that is first tool will come to this portion at the point from here mm -hmm. tool will be moving in this direction so that in this way work piece will be rotating in this cnc lathe machine the work piece will be rotating okay work piece will be rotating and then tool will be moving in this direction so that this is the first point second point third point fourth point fifth point okay now This is a graph. Is it plus? Is it minus? X plus? X minus. Okay. Now, this is the origin point. Okay. This is origin point. That is this point. So that as per the graph, what will be the first point? Point number one will be. So the first point. I don't understand. Now this is the graph. Yes, if you see. Ah, okay. Yes. Is that minus? X plus? X minus. Okay. 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 Now okay. this is the first point. This portion. Yeah. What will be the first part? No. The first point will be x x zero. Yeah. Z one one or is it? Yes. That is simply we can write p one x zero is at zero. Zero. Okay. Sure. It's clear. Yes, it's clear. Yeah. First part will be x zero is at zero. Next. Point number two. Now the tool will be moving in this direction. Tool will be moving from first point to second point. What will be the point number two? Will be x um, twenty z zero. Yeah. X twenty in the zero. So, what will be the point number three? Z uh, x same twenty z minus minus fifteen. X twenty is at the minus fifteen. Yeah. Next point yeah. number four. X thirty hmm. z minus fifteen. Sure. Point number four. X twenty. Sorry, x thirty. Yeah. X thirty is at minus fifteen. Point number five. X thirty is at minus thirty. Yeah. X thirty is at minus thirty. That's all. If you understand this coordinate. Okay, the program will be very easy. Program is nothing but a linear movement, a radius movement. Only <coughs> if you take this CNC programming, only four important commands are there. Okay, only four command. If you understand these four important commands, na program will be very easy. What are these four important commands, na? We we'll say G zero zero, G zero zero command. And then G zero one, G zero two, and then G zero three. Ah, okay. Ah, okay. This, That's what it is. Yeah. This, these are the four important commands in CNC programming. It's if you take any machine, CNC machines, 
If you take laser cutting or wood carving or the CNC turning machine, CNC milling machine, anything. What are the four important commands are there? G00, G01, G02, G03 commands. Now, if you understand this coordinates, if you understand this coordinates, now, program will be very easy. Okay, simple. Instead of this P1, P2, P3, we should write the commands. That is G001, G02, or G03, or some commands we should write. That's all. Okay, okay. fine. You can okay. copy this. Now, Okay. Here, this is dia 10. This will be dia 50, dia 30, dia 35. Five, 50, 5, 50. This is point number 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. What will be the point number 1? It's um, X0, Z0. Okay, point number 2. Uh, X10, Z0. Yeah, point number 3. X, X15. Z minus five. Yeah. Four point number two. X fifteen Z minus twenty. Perfect. X X thirty uh -huh. Z minus twenty. Twenty. Six. X X uh, thirty five Z minus let's say um, 25. Okay, point number 7. Okay. X minus uh, X35 Z uh, 40 minus 40. That's all. Point number 7 is X35. Uh, is it minus 40? Minus 40, yes. That's all. Okay. These are the simple basic things. Okay, if you know to calculate this. Then nothing but x plus everything will be in x plus everything will be in z minus. That's all. If you take a program, if you see the program, if you notify the program, maximum it will be in x plus and z minus. That's all. That is. In this graph, x plus z minus. Total program will be like this. Why? Because now why we are saying x indicates diameter now. When the program is running, if you see the program in a, when we start the program in a, job will be rotating. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So that the full area will be covered. So that X indicates diameter, Z indicates length. That's all. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yes. That, that's all. Yes. Okay. If you understand this X plus Z minus now, you can do the program easily. Okay. Sure. And then if you notice by the drawing, if you notify, notify means you can say this is a simple method. Next, if you go for the compare diagrams, it will be radius, some radius will be there here. Mm -hmm. Yes. 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 R Yes. 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 Yes.
Don't worry, I just okay. I just put it in the in the, in the machine and it works. You can copy this diagram. Okay. Okay. I should get copy. No need of this. About radius. In this two corner, we are having the radius. Suppose this is R2, R3. This diameter is 10. This diameter is 12. Now, this is point number 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Now, what will be the point number 1? It will be x0, z0. Yeah. Point number 2. Point number 2 will be x6, uh, z0. Yeah, point number 3. X ten Z two Z minus two. Z minus two. X ten minus two. Oh am I wrong? Point number three. Point number three. Number number two. Number three is an uh, X ten and Z minus minus two. Yes. Point number one, the x is zero, z is zero. Yeah. Yes. And point number two. Point number two, the x is six, z zero. Yes. Yeah. Next point number three, x ten, is at the minus two. Minus two. Yes. This R two will be. Two, yes. Point number four, x ten is at minus twenty. Total value. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Point number five. What is the point number five? Will be what's thirteen x twenty six. Yeah. When z minus twenty. X from P6 to Z minus 20. Point number yes. 6. Yeah. X 30. Yeah. Z minus 23. X 30. Z minus 23. Oh, am I wrong? 23. Yeah. yeah. 23, yes. 23. Point number 7. X is 30 and then you have minus 40. Yeah. Yes. That's all. If you know how to calculate this radius, you can able to put the, but instead of this P1, P2, P3, wherever you need, then we will be putting G03, G02 like this. Come on. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> now this is clear. Yes. That is clear. That is clear. Yes. Okay, you can copy this. Okay.